Hello and welcome to ecomhardy.com. This is Hardik Patel and in this video I'm gonna show you how to fix this two image showing up on the product page of the WordPress WooCommerce website and how to fix this issue in particularly like quicker way than you ever imagined. So if you search on Google saying like there are too many images showing up on the product page and how to fix you will see like there are a lot of forum answered but those are not really answered in a easy way and you won't find the easy answer so that's the main purpose of this particular video i made and if you like this video then feel free to thumbs up to this video and subscribe to my channel for more amazing useful tutorial videos in the future and it will also encourage me to make more videos so let's get started if you go to admin panel and if you see here i have sg optimizer plugin that's caching plugin activated and the theme wise if i go to appearance and themes i can show you the themes the main active theme is Wustify. in your case could be different theme and in your case could be different caching plugin this is the 2023 um the WordPress default theme for 2023. Now let me keep the Wustify theme active and go to the front end of the you know website. Make sure to watch this video till the end to help yourself save some time and find out how to fix the issue. So once you go to the home page, go to shop page or even on the main page if you go and check out any product. So if I click onto the product, you can see the main image is showing up twice when i hover over it disappears that means something is related to caching or the theme uh, code conflict and how to fix here so if i go back to my admin panel and if i go to the themes if i under the themes if i change to the default theme and see whether this is related to the theme issue then after changing to 2023 purge the cache and then go back to the main product page and find any product and see the issue has been resolved here so what is that happening now i understand there is something wrong with the theme which is conflicting with the caching plugin if i deactivate the caching could be possible the issue is being resolved let me turn on the Wustify theme back to online now let me deactivate the caching plugin and see whether the issue is getting resolved or not so uh, install plugins here sg optimizer deactivate and once it's deactivated go back to the product page refresh and the issue is resolved so that means either if you change the theme the issue is being fixed or if you change the caching plugin or either deactivating the caching plugin the issue is being resolved but in your case you want to keep both options you want to keep your favorite theme and you want to use your uh, favorite caching plugin so now we're gonna work it out both having activated together and we'll work it out how to fix the issue now go to SG optimizer or in your case could be anything wp rocket or any other caching plugin options so under the caching plugin if you go to caching here and you can see on the option side only dynamic caching is active you can deactivate that option and then refresh the page after cache purge and see if the issue is being resolved if still not go to the front end and toggle off any of these option one by one purge the cache let, let me show you uh, one option so in my case like javascript i just toggle the minify javascript file off and then purge the cache and if i go to the front end of the product page you can see the issue is not resolved so that means this is not the root cause sorry this is not the root cause i can toggle on now you have to do one by one to each of these options uh, until you find out what is the root cause in your case also because it's related to the images it could be um, the image side so if you go to media options and 
check out the options which are active in my case only lazy lazy load media is active so i just toggle off after you deactivated that option just simply purge the cache and see if the issue is being resolved so right now the page is not refreshed i just simply refresh the page after purge cache and see voila the issue has been resolved so in my case this particular option is the culprit which is cause causing the you know issue now once after deactivating that particular option you can decide whether you want to keep this option or this particular plugin or you can find out the alternative plugin and if you are flexible to the theme side also you can also always change the theme as well hope you enjoy watching this video guys hope this video has been helpful to you some, uh, somehow and hope this answered your question now thumbs up to this video if it will encourage me to make more and more useful videos in the future also subscribe to my youtube channel and click on to the notification icon so you will get notified when i create any useful content on this channel feel free to go to my ecomhardy.com website and check out useful blogs as well that's it for now thanks for watching see you next time take care see you bye bye